stop paying attention. No. Stop watching. No. Fine, I'll stop watching you. You start watching me. I will. Okay, we're playing Yakuza good. 4. Yep. Part 4, Kazuma Kiryu-chan. Kiryu-chan! Chapter 1, Reunion. With who? Who are we reunited with? And does it feel so good? Hmm. Are we reuniting like you knew we could? Hmm. Alright, that's us. Is that us? We looking bald. Who the fuck is this cue ball looking motherfucker? He didn't die! He didn't die. What? He's alive! Yo, we have a friend. No, we don't. This was the guy who stabbed us at the end of three. Oh, well, I mean... Like, I think he's gonna... I think he turned his ways around, but yeah. This is the guy who betrayed us and stabbed us at the end of three. That's why Haruka's like, ah! Because she, she recognizes him. It's him. He stabbed you. He's not dead. You... No. <laughs> I think I think he actually got his head out of his ass because he told Saijima to come to come to us for help. So I feel like he I feel like he's getting ready to want to try and turn a new leaf around or some shit. Nah. I mean, if Kiryu can do it. Yeah, you just never know who's gonna die in this game. She remembers you stabbing me in the stomach in the middle of the day. Yeah. You stabbed me. Where is Hamazaki? You... You Because he didn't want to be in prison! I'm just gonna not get caught. サイジマという男がここを訪れた。その時お前の名前を口にしていたんだが、その話本当か？いや。ああ。そうか。サイジマのやつちゃんと生き延びていたのか？そうか。やはり知り合いなのか。ああ。それでサイジマはどうした？はい、サイジマ。ちゃんとカムロ町には行けたのか？いや、無かった。その後無事にたどり着いたかまでは分からないかな。そうか。そうか。お前、あのサイジマって男とはどういう関係なんだ？Just inmate bros. Nothing more. 兄弟だ。やつは俺の兄弟分だ。兄弟。キル。あんたにどうしても頼みがある。何してるんだ。お前。俺は兄弟を男にしてやりて。だから頼む。俺の最初で最後の頼み聞いてくれ。I <笑> mean, I'll hear you out, but it's not looking good for you because you know you fucking stabbed me. For real, what? But I mean, we don't care. I guess not <laughs> bygones be bygones. So, Hamazaki, what do you want? I mean, me, Kiryu and Majima beat the piss out of each other on almost a goddamn regular basis, and we're still like the closest of friends ever. <laughs> Nishiki beat the shit out of us and then fucking blew himself up with fucking billions of yen. Yeah. And then back to Majima, just fucking, they're the best of friends. <laughs> they're really good friends. Uh. Well, it's kind of a long story, but Saijima. He's the guy who bumped off Yoshikaru Ueno. Chairman of the Ueno Saiwa back in 85. Wait. That's... Yup. 
You spend enough time in Camarocho, you're going to hear the story. Saijima killed 18 men all by himself that day. That's what they say. Anyways, the two of us only just met. Both locked up in a private prison a stone's throw away from here. What do you mean, private prison? I mean, the government's not involved. They put the contract in place, yeah, but the private sector's been running the joint since the day they broke ground. They call it Okinawa Penitentiary, Penitentiary Number 2. Take you never heard the name? No, I had no I had no idea a place like that existed in Okinawa. They officially call it a correctional facility, but that's a load of bull. It's a dumping ground for washed-up Yakuza they want to snuff out for good. It was only a few days ago that Saijima got shipped down from whatever shithole they had him in up in Tokyo. Which is when you met. <clears throat> Bingo. And you two planned the jailbreak together? More or less. Though I'm the one who came up with the idea, if I'm being honest. Why'd you pick Saijima as your partner? You saw him, right? Guy's built like a freaking brick wall. More importantly, I knew what really happened back in 85. The truth. Go on. Back in the day, Saijima was real tight with Majima. Yeah, that Majima. And that Ueno Saiwa hit? The one where Saijima slaughtered those 18 guys? That was originally going to be a two-man job. Saijima and Majima. Majima-san and Saijima were accomplices? Yep, but the day of the attack, Majima never showed. The betrayal is how I convinced Saijima to break out with me. It explains why Saijima was talking about revenge when he was here. It's all bullshit, though. Majima would never have betrayed his brother. They were both set up. By who? Guy named Shibata. Was heading up was heading up a third-tier Tojo family at the time. Problem is, Saijima and I split before I got to tell him what really happened. I think I can guess the favor you want. Yeah. You gotta tell him the truth, no matter what. Why is it so important? As it stands, Saijima's gonna try and kill Majima. Not only that, but... But? But, I really respect him. He doesn't deserve to be living life in the dark, you know? Hmm. I mean, sure, I only asked him to help me bust out because of how tough he is. But he actually started trusting me during the escape. Me, of all people. Look, my life's been nothing but betrayal after betrayal. I've been on both sides of that coin. But two people look beyond all that. Chose to trust me, anyway. You and Saijima. Hamazaki. I want another chance to start over. Be a true brother to a guy who went out on a limb and actually trusted me. So I'm begging you, kiryu san You gotta help me. One question first. What's that? Why do you need me to do it? Can't you go tell Saijima all this yourself? Well, I... What is it, Hamazaki? I died for him that night. I'm dead. Oh yeah, the ledger he was looking to get. What <laughs> さっとの取引に使おうとしていた物だ。沖縄第二刑務所なんて限りなく非合法に近い施設が生まれた経緯と、その資金面での金の流れが書かれている。これは。東条クライント神宮、and then Jingu to the police. Oh shit. あんたも関係したあの東条会の消えた百億事件。ニャクザ2。実はあの事件で動いていたあの金も沖縄第二刑務所設立の裏資金となるはずの金だったんだ。Oh shit, this is what we got to do with it. Jingu was the one Jingu was Haruka's birth father. Oh. He was the one trying to become like a super prime minister type person in Yakuza 2 who was going to try and kill Yumi and the daughter, which is why Kazuma stepped in and fucking told them not to do it. So that's what Kiryu has to do with it. The Tojo clan was given the money to Jingu, who was going to then give the money to the police to fucking keep back in this penitentiary. A year back, when I was still suckling the Tojo clan teeth, I found out that the top brass over at Tokyo PD had their hands dirty. Real dirty, with tons of shady cash. Bet you can guess where I learned all that. The snake flower. Yup. They'd been working with one of the top men on the force for years. Laundered his money through foreign banks and everything. Why go through all that trouble, though? What did the police need with all that cash? What they needed was to build what one of their highest-ranking boys called their utopia. Penitentiary number two. Right again. The idea was they'd build a place and toss all the convicted Yakuza they round up, then go and make deals with it, with those very same Yakuza. 
What kind of deals? Stuff like bribing people to commit crimes. Then when the cops came in and saved the day, everyone would think that they were the heroes. Crime would become a police-controlled affair. That's absurd. Yeah, an absurd power grab. Whoever handled those crimes would get big brownie points on the force, end up rocketing up the ranks. I still can't believe the 10 billion Jingo was trying to launder through the dojo was supposed to end up with the cops. Believe me, I was just as surprised as you when I found out. Even with the money getting blown to high heaven, the paper trail alone is some serious shit. Honestly, the only reason I grabbed this file in the first place is because I wanted a little dirt on the warden. Something I could use to bargain my way out of there, you know? But I gotta say, I never thought I'd stumble on a shitstorm this messy. Almost feels like it's out of my league, if you get me. I show up on Tokyo PD's doorstep with this baby in tow, and that'd be the last anyone ever hears of me. Hmm. Turns out this file's not the bargaining chip I was hoping it'd be. It's yours now. But why me? Because you were at the center of everything that went down five years ago. Hell, you even had to beat the shit out of your own brother at the end of it all. Then... But kids, I have them now. <sighs> Idiot. Come on, don't give me the silent treatment here. You fucking stabbed me. <laughs> I just don't get it. Why did you show me that? I already told you. You gotta go to Kamurocho and tell my boy Saitama what really... There's more to it than that. I know there is. Besides, you would end up behind bars again in no time without this bargaining chip of yours. So tell me, Hamazaki, what are you really after? Oh, no. Now what do we see? Tojo clan destroyed Kamurocho Hills and we know Saibo clan to the... They are going to try and give Kamurocho Hills to the Tokyo Police Department? Why? I live in Okinawa now. I'm not even... I'm, I'm clean. That's true, too. Like, Kiryu does still have, like, a sense of loyalty to the clan for everything they've done for him over the years. So that's probably why he's gonna do it. But, like... Damn. Let my boy get out of the game! <laughs> March 2010, the next day. Taichi in the house! Yo. We're home, Uncle Kaz. Looks like you kids had a good trip. You enjoy yourselves? Oh, yeah, it was awesome. We hiked, went camping, even saw some old bones and stuff at a museum. Wasn't it super cool, Koji? Mm-hmm. You gotta go with us sometime, Uncle Kaz. How was your grades trip, Ayako? Great. ねえねえおじさん。あの人は甘崎さんだ。俺の昔からの知り合いで。だね。近寄らないで。はるか、姉ちゃん。この子たちに近づかないで。はるか。おじさんは黙ってて。this is all fair. Like Haruka almost lost yet another parent. She watched her mother get shot. And she watched her dad kill her mother. She watched her dad die, and then she almost lost her actual her actual father figure. So like I don't blame Haruka for any of this. その子たちに近づこうとして。はるか、もういいだろ。よくない。いいわけないじゃない。おじさんは本当に浜崎って人のこと信用してるの。ああ。してるよ。もういい。もう私、おじさんがどうなっても知らないから。like, this is all fair. Yep. Like, she has every right to be super upset. She lost 
the per like she almost lost another one of her parent parental figures. Bark, bark, rough, rough, bark. Haruka isn't too keen on Hamazaki. I should talk to her and ease her mind. <clears throat> I mean, we can do that. Like, we can just let her know that if Hamazaki tries that shit again, I'll just beat his ass. <laughs> he only stabbed me because he got to jump on me. I wasn't ready for him to stab me when he fucking did his false bullshit. You're going back to Kamarocho, aren't you? Haruka, I... I just don't get it, Uncle Kaz. How can you trust him so easily? He stabbed you in broad daylight, Uncle Kaz. You almost died. I'll never trust him. Never in a million years. Haruka, please. Whenever I see him, I just think back to what happened last year. What he did to you. That memory terrifies me, Uncle Kaz. Haruka. I've always believed in you. You know I have. But this time, I'm really worried. It feels like if you go to Tokyo now, you're never going to come home. You heard us talking last night, huh? Maybe you want to know what happened five years ago, but I don't care one way or another. I just want you to be safe. You don't care. Haruka, you lost both your parents in that instant. I lost Nishiki and Kazuma-san. If there really was something more going on behind the scenes, wouldn't you want to know what it was? I... I'm happy just being here with you, Uncle Kaz. That's all I need. Not the truth. Just you. Haruka. <laughs> キリュウ Guess I'm gonna head down to the station now. Turn myself in. Already? Sooner the better, I figure. Anyway, I'll be seeing you, kiddie san Hold on. Do you even know where the police station is? <clears throat> I'm an adult. I got eyes. I'll find it. I'm coming with you, Hamazaki. We might have had our differences, but you at least deserve a proper send-off after all we've been through together. Heh. <laughs> Suit yourself. Help I gotta check. They didn't fucking shave Saijima's head. When he was in prison. Oh, I guess not. What the fuck? Well, I don't know. <laughs> he still got them fucking flowing locks. Like, Hamazaki's bald. They got him. But fucking... Yeah. So we're missing one more... Actually. Yeah, we're actually missing just... Oh. Oh. Oh, this is interesting. Anyway. Okay. It's go time, Kiryu-san. You ready? Let's do it. Yeah, let's do it. Let's get you back behind bars. sure about this, Hamazaki. 100%. The only way I'm reuniting with Saijima is when we're both back in the slammer. Hamazaki. Please, why won't you listen to me? My brother was sent to a prison in Okinawa. I know he was. You can say that all you want, lady, but I've never heard of this penitentiary number two you keep going on about. Now go home already. No, please, you have to listen to me. I'm begging you. We already have listened. <sighs> listen. 
I already told you, we looked through the logs of every prisoner ship down here. Your brother isn't and has never been in an Okinawa prison. He is. I just know he is. Please. Check for Taiga Saijima one more time. Please, officer. What? Huh? Here's Lily. あんた、もしかして。サイジマタイガの知り合いか。え、え。タイガは私の兄です。ちょっと警察署の前では都合が悪いな。もしよければ少しお話を聞かせてもらえませんか。え、もしかして兄のことで何かご存知なんですか。とにかく人目のつかない場所に行こう。お付き合いいただけますか。All right, let's tell her the truth. <clears throat> it's not a good place to tell her the truth. The heck is this place, no. Kiyu? The ex-hideout of a family called the Tamashiro I crossed swords with last year. It's been empty for a while now. If there's anything we... If there's anywhere we won't be interrupted, it's here. Oh no, Tamashiro! The gang! So, are you ready to talk? We might be able to find out where your brother is if we pull all the information we have. Right. <clears throat> now, you said you were Taiga Saijima's sister. That's right. My name is Yasuko Saijima. I haven't seen my brother for 25 years now. Every single day I tried to visit him in prison, but they never once let me in to see him. Not a single time in all those years. Then, just a few days ago, I heard he was being transferred. Penitentiary number two down in Okinawa. Hmm. As soon as they told me, I left Kamarocho and raced down here. But no matter how many times I ask, all the authorities insist such a place has never existed. That's what we walked in on. Yes, I'm at my wit's end here. Yasuko-san, yeah? <clears throat> Anyone who told you penitentiary number two doesn't exist either doesn't know the truth or was lying to you. It's real, all right. What? I should know. I've been there. You have? Oh yeah, they gave it some fancy name and number like a regular old prison, but it's not actually government run. You ever hear of a private prison? Of course. And that's what penitentiary number two is? Yep. Details are going to have to come later, though. I've got some more important news for you first. Truth of the matter is, I know your brother. You know Taiga? Mm-hmm. Oh, and here's another grand truth for you. He's long gone from Okinawa. Probably reached Kamarocha by now, if I had to guess. Me and him broke out together a few days ago. You... What? He's telling the truth. Your brother washed up at my orphanage the next day, and I ended up giving him some money to get up to Camarocho. Sorry, Yasuko. You just missed him. In that case, I can't afford to waste any more time here. I need to get back to Camarocho at once. Yeah! No! I thought we weren't going to be interrupted, Kiryu. For real. Police? どうした。変な連中が大量にビルに入ってきやがった。刺すかもしれん。どうするキリュ。今警察に捕まったら説明するのに時間がかかる。とりあえずここでよ。はい。はい、キリュが見たんすポリスオフィスナウ。さっきに
So that's the bitch who went running to the police, begging to see Saijima. Who are these guys, Hamasaki? Guards from that shithole penitentiary I was telling you about. These pricks are the cruelest goons in the business. Heh. Rich, coming from an escaped convict. Look, I'll go back with you, whatever I gotta do. Just leave these two out of it. They don't got a damn thing to do with this. No can do. Don't worry, Hamasaki. We're not gonna kill you, but you're gonna need a serious attitude adjustment once we get back in the slammer. Might have to beat you till you change. Either way, that bitch isn't going anywhere. Why? This is between you and me. Sorry. Warden's orders. He told me to bring in Taiga Saitama's sister. And that's exactly what I'm gonna do. Me? But why would... This is a load of bull. Hamazaki. Huh? Take care of Yasuko-san. What? What are you saying, Kiryu? I'll handle the guards. You stay behind me and keep her safe, understand? Yeah. You hear that? If you want to get to Yasuko, you're gonna have to go through me, the dragon of Dojima, fourth chairman of the Dojo clan. And who are you, tough guy? Someone who spent most of... Almost a quarter of his life in prison. And I can tell, you're no ordinary guards. <laughs> Step aside, pal, or who knows, we might just accidentally beat you to death. I think you'll find that's not as easy as you expect. Heh, <laughs> your funeral. No more fucking around! Slaughter him! Dude. Does nobody know who I am? I am me. Curious fighting style. He's just all about... Oh, damn. Yeah, this is the stuff. Yeah, this is the stuff. Yeah, beat him up. Oh, I got it. We got beat up. Yeah, we did. Yeah, he's just not... What a pansy using the baton. This, this bitch is relentless. Oh, I don't I don't have any fucking I don't have any weapons. You have fists how you like it. your combo as much as you may want to. Uh, oh my god. He's laying me the fuck out. I'm like, I can't, it's, it's a guard break too. Okay, I was definitely blocking that. Oh my goodness. Yeah, like as soon as I try and go for the heavy, he just... Yup. Oh my god. Throw out the foot. What the? Like, do I still have? Do I have both of my abilities? What is this? I like her name. Okay, Lotus Flare Fist. Oh, we want double Okay. Maki dot shot. There we go. 
No, I just had to get the. I just had to fucking spend some of my orbs to get my moves back. Now I have the baton. But now where do I go though? Why get ready to shoot but not shoot? Ah, uh, because it's evil. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> After reaching level 10, come on. Oh. Not what I meant to do. Oh. Ah. It, this pistol has infinite ammo. Hey! Wait, no, it's gotta reload. It's just has infinite durability! Oh no, the reload.
後の処理は俺がやるだからあんたは一刻も早く最初のところへ She doesn't even know where he's at. He's just in Kamarocho. That's a big place. Oh my. Do you okay? I'm going to go to the house. 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 I'm going 俺はお前に頼まれてするわけじゃない。カムロ町に行くのは俺の意思だ。早く行けこっちのことは心配するな。ああ。行こう、ヤスコさん。はい。浜崎さん、ありがとうございました。兄に、<笑>あなたのような親友がいたこと、誇らしく思います。Friends going a bit farther, yes. I'm going to go. So you know. I'm going to go. I'm going to go. I'm going to go. Friends a bit of a stretch, yes. Look at her run with high heels on. Probably. Probably. Well, dang. Kiryu. <laughs>